Greetings all, Frog here. Let's play some GeoGuessr, where we are going to play the State Lands Challenge for the week, which is State Lands 32, and uh, Mr. Beauty Bread has called this Enigma. And it made me want to get out the Enigma variations and play them as background music, but uh, while the Enigma variations themselves are in the public domain, barely, uh, the there, uh, there's no recording that I could think of that would be. So, you know... Turn off the background music and play your own version? I don't know. Go with me. It's an enigma. I don't know why. This looks like Ohio. It looks like a hell portion of Ohio. So the Northwest. But the, that gas card station would not be there. Sunnyside. Baptist Church. I feel like I've been here before. Which, if you saw last week's uh, Eurovista challenge, you know that doesn't mean a damn thing. Five minutes still? Yeah, okay, still five minutes. Just making sure the rules of the game had not changed. And they have not up until this point. That is a lot of animals. Well, that is not a helpful sign. Pardon me for the yawn right there. Picnic area. Brilliant. It does increase the likelihood that this is a U.S. highway, though. Although, definitely in Sunnyside. Oh, thanks. I feel like there's a... Oh, it says to watch for ice, so we're definitely... Well, that one was watch for water. We appear to be in the Midwest. 70 miles an hour on a two-lane road? This is insane. It must be in Montana. And of course, it's one of those situations where this is the only main road anywhere nearby. So they don't have to mark it because if you're driving here, you know what you're on. Because either you've never left this main road, and so you got here somehow, or you live here near Sunnyside. And there's no reason to, to know what this road is because you already know what this road is. Wagoner. All right, well, we spent two minutes going this direction. Which means we should have gone north, I'm sure. We're in Lamb County. Brilliant. My guess right now is southeastern Montana. I have absolutely nothing to go on for that. I mean, literally nothing. That says El Paso natural gas. So now I think I'm in Texas. Is there a Sunnyside, Texas, near El Paso? El Paso's on the left in part of the state. Some people might say the west. Horizon City. You could just as easily be in one of the surrounding states. I don't see a sunny side, but God knows how long that natural gas goes. So look, here's the thing, to get some points, let's say we're somewhere by El Paso. I don't see a sunny side. No, we can send you. Get out of here. Thank you. That could be the ultimate in red herrings. But I could see this being Western Texas. That is true. I wouldn't expect as much ice, but it's possible. This is not as likely. Newer and compost, 806 is the area code. No, I have not memorized them yet. How dare you ask such a filthy question. What do you say? Mr. Truck. What do you suggest? 
Usage is nothing. It's Republic Transport. <clears throat> Excuse me. They're all over. Should have gone north. I could tell already. I should have gone north. In 25 seconds, am I going to get a Hail Mary? No, but I kind of want to be over by Lubbock. I really don't like that. I really kind of want to be by Lubbock. I can't explain to you why. I just do. Oh, man. That... Yeah. Yeah. I always should have been by Lubbock. Forget Sunnyside. That was nowhere. Admittedly, I was going to click, like, by Leveland. But still would have been a better score than, score than I got there. Brutal. Brad, you're on fire, my friend. Do you just play until you get a 5,000 score? Okay, no, that's not true. Maybe this is Enigma because every place that you find doesn't exist on the map. That would be just absolutely terrifying. It's a standard waste management sign. Look, I know my ability to see in these blurry things. I'm not going to be able to read that sign that was back there. Alright. Slightly less blurry, still blurry. We're going this way. Why? Don't know. Looks looks very Michigan-esque. So it'll be Arkansas. It's like a metro park. You know what I mean? Can't go that way. I don't want to go that way. I want to go across the tracks. That looks like a highway. No joke, this kind of looks like where my parents live. Get on the highway. Now it doesn't really look like where my parents live, but that little bit did. It just says exit. Perfect. This is just brilliant, this is. Thank you for not taking me down there. What does that say? Get over there. No, I want to be on that side. Ooh. Plover and Amherst? County Road B. Perfect. There's an Amherst, Ohio, but this does not look like it. I mean, maybe. It's a white plate. That doesn't do us any good. Why, why are we just randomly jumping to the other side of the expressway? This is brutal. This is a bit of a nightmare. Clover and Amherst. Me. Yeah, let's go off actually. I like this. And then see what it says we're getting onto. I'm down with this. Alright. What are we getting onto? What? 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 Why is there no. Okay, what? What do you. It's a US highway. US 10? It's US 10. Okay, that's not the United States. US 10. Where does that drive? It doesn't go through Ohio, does it? If it does, it's one of the southern ones that I can never remember. Okay, it's not. US 10. Where is US 10? This is going to be a horrible score. If I was US 10, Amherst is also in Massachusetts. Is there a US 10 over here? 202, the 20, the 3. The 44, and the 6. I didn't realize the 6 went all the way out there. Cool. I used to live off the 6. 
It is in Amherst, New York. Is there a 10? Clearly my next memorization is going to have to be all of the Amhersts in the United States. Nope. Nope. No idea where U.S. Highway 10 is. No clue. We'd have to stumble on it. And I don't like those chances. It looks like the Midwest, yeah? If this isn't Michigan, I'm going to be so embarrassed. I can't think of an Amherst in Michigan. I also can't think of U.S. 10 in Michigan. Doesn't mean it doesn't happen. I just can't think of it. Is it in Wisconsin? There is a one. Yes. Wapaka, in point of fact, is right there. We're on the 10. We're not really on the 10. We were just by the 10. But I'm going with that guess. There's Amherst. Go over there. Oh, what a last minute grab. He dives for the line. And he barely gets over the edge. But it's just good enough for third place. Or north of Amherst. It indeed was a park. Old Highway 18, as it were. We're actually in, in Amherst Junction. All right, I'll take it. That's damn well luck right there. Alrighty. Revival. Get the tent. This is the Southside Baptist Church. Southside. No? Okay. Get in the intersection. Let me go west. This looks like Alabama. So it's probably Wisconsin. Although we were just in Wisconsin, so... What's this now? Was that a Louisiana sign? Where did it go? What the hell just happened? It's probably behind the truck. What the hell is going on now? Get over here. That looks like a much bigger road. It is Louisiana. It's the Louisiana too damn sunny. 255? 265 perhaps. 1255. That's that's insane. But alright, we're in Louisiana. I don't feel that bad. Alabama, Louisiana. Right, we're in Louisiana. Let's say we're by Monroe. For S and G. 1255. Seems like it would not be a very big road. But we'll give it a gander. I don't see any four digit. There's one. 3033. 1255. Well, don't go past the river, because that seems unlikely. Baton Rouge! Okay, you can go past the river over here, but not up there. 1255. Oh, excuse me. Getting a little tired. A lot of recording to go. No live stream tonight if you're watching this on Tuesday. I posted about it on Twitter, or at least I will by the time this goes live. So I've got a lot of recording to do. That's Houston, Texas. Would you believe Houston, Texas? All right. Going north. That's the Southside Baptist Church we were by. Now we're going kind of away from town. I don't really like this choice. Super value. What does that say? Wallace Woodworks Custom Doors. South Hudson. Well, that's good. That's at least a city. Lafayette, Louisiana. I don't know why I just said that. South Hudson. I don't remember seeing that, unfortunately. Plenty of time to look, though. It would be appropriate that South Hudson would be in the north. 
Because why wouldn't it be? I don't see it anywhere. Hmm. I don't like us sitting way up there. I'm gonna bring us down a bit. Probably a mistake. Appear to be going through the town of South Hudson. There's the stoplight. That looks like an expressway. Can we get through to the expressway, please? I want I want that. No, you don't understand. I want that. Aha. It's just a big bridge. Well, shocks. So Sonic, I'm a big fan of the Sonics. Mr. Water Tower, what do you have for me? JSB, don't even know. We're sticking with that one. If it's up by Monroe, I'll be sad. And that'll be the way of it. I'm not sad, but it would have been closer if I'd guessed Monroe. It's just south of Jonesboro. Actually, we're in Jonesboro. South Hudson is obviously the street. Yep. Son of a gun. There's the Sonic. That was US-167 I stumbled on at the very end. Why I can't see that road sign, I don't know. 1255 doesn't even exist as a separate road marker. This game gets you every time. That's lovely. We're going to go to the railroad crossing, because why not? For a second there, I didn't think we'd actually get to one. This does not appear to be in use. Montpellier! There's a car following me. Front plate? There is one. Looks kind of like Michigan's plates, except Michigan doesn't use a front plate, so... Figure that one out. Main Street and 4th Avenue. This is the Main Street. Is it now? Montpellier! North Dakota. <clears throat> Where exactly is Montpellier, North Dakota? There are more cities in North Dakota than I had expected. I'll be flat out honest with you. I don't see a Montpellier. I don't even see an area of the state that has a lot of French names in it. There's Cavalier. Well, to know. I'll oh, okay, to the north then. Montpellier is a little small. There's got to be a reason this came up. I mean, what's this town? What was here? Something had to have been here. You know what I mean? Like, towns don't just spring up randomly, they spring up for reasons. What was this town's reason? Wow. Unbroken road forever. I mean, we have everything we need. We're in Montpellier. Question is, where the heck is that?
Alright, we gotta take this systematically. Here we go. Looking for Montpellier. We got two minutes to do this. I'm not seeing it. Look, it's not on the map, it's the Enigma. in an intelligent fashion. Mm -hmm. And forks. It's on the border. If you see it out, shout it out at home, just like we're on Blue's Clues. That wasn't a real attempt at it. I don't want to get uh, content matched. I do not see Montpellier anywhere. Gotta pick up the pace a little bit. For any M's. At the bottom of the state. Montpellier, you have failed me. I hate you a little. Not a lot, just a little. Alright, look. French names were up here. I don't know, man. Well, we have to put down a guess. So I'll throw down a guess. So we get some sort of points. It was not a road well traveled. That much is clear. You got me stumped. Well, we're just going to have to deal with that as it is. Man, I don't like it. Brutal. I mean, how do you possibly find out that Montpellier, because you got to 281, I'm sure. Yeah, of course. If you go the other way. If you don't go the way I go. I mean, how do you deal with that? <clears throat> Seriously. There's no way to deal with that. I was on 49th Street Southeast, by the way. Like, if I choose to go this way, I figure it out. I may not see Montpellier, but I figure it out. You can't just, like, there's no skill that says, oh, we'll go that way. Because that's the way to go. Like, right now, I have two choices, right? I can go back. I can go forward. I'm going to go back because I feel like this is the right answer. If going north is the proper answer, what, I don't know. Break check area. In the Rockies, huh? Maybe I just have to click faster. Maybe I play at too leisurely a pace. Which is ridiculous, because I play a three-minute world challenge, although I don't care about the score as much. This is the break check area. What's that say? If you can read this, you don't need breaks. No idea. I sure would love to be on that side of the road. Oregon. Nope, oh, it's not. Something. Something pass. could be an Oregon Mountain Pass. You just can't tell. It doesn't look like it on second glance. What are we warning us about now, Mr. Blue Sign? Tuned to radio 1610 AM. Why is that not standardized? How has the government not said, look, we appreciate that you were you were broadcasting on 1610. Now it's going to be the broad government traffic broadcast information system. And then nobody can broadcast on 1610, so it's always 1610 everywhere. You know what I mean? Like, on my commute, this is just my commute. I only drive 25 minutes uh, away. On my commute, there are two different traffic radio stations. Two. What's the point of that? Oh, hell. I hope I'm still going the right direction. Relative to where I was going, of course.
Guys, there's no guards there. guardrails there. Guys, there are no guardrails there. Guys! There's no guardrails. What, 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 what the hell is this? There's no guardrails! Oh my god. Oh, there's like three feet of road there. Yeah, not there! This looks like more like the Cascades than the Rockies, to be honest with you. Maybe we actually are in Oregon. I'll bet anything had it gone the other way, we'd have found the answer by now. That's how it always works. You a park ranger or something? What's going on with you? You're the sheriff. Fantastic. You're rotting him? <sighs> okay. Ninety seconds to go. It's gonna be an embarrassing finish. Oh, I blasted way by that sign. As it is, it's a construction based sign anyway. Okay, um, Mountains, lots of them. Cascades, maybe. Maybe down Mount Hood. There was a river. Like, maybe we're hiking along the 14, State Route 14 there. Hell, I don't know. Let's try it. What's the worst that could happen? <clears throat> I don't score well on this. I don't need this for my self-worth. I'm, I'm, I'm confident enough, thank you. Trying to go back to that blue sign. There was absolutely a blue sign back here. There's no way I blasted by it that far. Oh, you gotta be kidding me. 530 if I knew if I'd memorized my goes. Yeah, I don't like where I guess this. I don't like that at all. I'd rather be in Idaho, to be honest with you, but it's too late now. We're in California, the Shasta Trinity National Forest, in point of fact. Had I gone the other way, I would have gone into Weaverville. I don't know how that would have helped me, but it would have happened. Maybe I would have seen a California root sign because I was in, in that place. Who knows? Horrible score. Jesus, 18302. It's not going to hold. It's top five right now, but it's not going to hold. Wow, human calculator, 216. You got a perfect score? What is that insanity? It's not often you see bearded bread just destroyed, but um, I guess nine points isn't destroyed, but man. I feel, uh, I feel humbled by this one. But it's very interesting. Uh, uh, definitely going to keep playing them. So... Hopefully you guys found it interesting too and you enjoyed it. If you did click that like button, consider subscribing to the channel to stay updated to everything as it happens. And until next time, cheers.